So you have a Cox cable remote, something like this, and you have an issue where one button or two buttons or three buttons or several buttons are not working. What I want you to do is this, okay? So first thing is go ahead and pop out your batteries. And this is only going to work for 50% of you guys, okay? So if it works for you, give this video a thumbs up. If it didn't, give it a thumbs down. Again, at least 50% of you guys should be up and running by the end of this video. Okay, so as soon as the batteries are out, what I want you to do is look at your power button here, and I, want, and I want you to press and hold this power button. Press and hold it for 30 seconds. Do not let go. I'm still holding on to the power button. After 30 seconds is up, go ahead and let go. Now what I want you to do is I want you to press, starting with the power button, and then every other button, I want you to press. Keep pressing. Give it some force, little force, light force. Because typically what happens is if you get water or hand sweat, lotion, coffee, soda, stuck in one of these buttons, it can cause all kinds of issues on the entire remote. Okay, so again, press every single button all the way down, every single number, up, down, left, right. Don't forget even all these other buttons up here, the menu, the guide, the setup, the input, power. And now give it a couple of whacks. Now go ahead and pop in the batteries and see if the remote is working now. If it's not, do the same thing. Take out the batteries again, press and hold the power button for 30 seconds. After 30 seconds is up, let go, and then press every single button on here. Just go crazy. Give it a couple smacks, get that dust and debris out in one of the buttons or however many buttons it's stuck on. Pop the batteries in and give it a try again, okay? Now, if your remote is still down, Give this method a few more times. Again, take out the batteries, hold hold down the power button for 30 seconds. Try it for a few more times. If it's still not working, the last thing I want you to try is just go ahead and try a new pair of batteries. Pop it in there and see if that works, okay? Anyways, if it worked, thumbs up. If it didn't, thumbs down. Good luck.